I'm interior designer Keith Baltimore and welcome to my client's home in the Hamptons. This is a brand new home built from the ground up, a blank canvas just waiting for a vision, which is always a dream for a designer. So with this place, my clients wanted a home that celebrated easy living, relaxation, and all that we love about the summer. And I cannot wait to show you what we did. I wanted to take the weight of the world off your shoulders the minute you walked in. Establishing that sense of relaxation was the name of the game in this double height foyer. First of all, large windows in the front and the back establish that this place is all about indoor outdoor living. This is a theme we really embraced. We kept things minimal with curated pieces that show off the client's love of travel and the beach. For example, this bench is shaped like surfboards and we upholstered it in this cozy textured fabric. We sourced the credenza from Brazil, laid down a geometric rug with the colors of the Atlantic, and we hung this fantastic oversized chandelier. This entry screams welcome to the Hamptons, and boy is it good to be here. This is not your typical dining room. Dining rooms are usually the most unused real estate in the house. I often think that it's the best real estate, usually in the front of the house, has gorgeous exposure. I chose a large banquette, very long dining table, and two delicious swivel chairs that you just want to hang in. Yes, I put a TV into the dining room. That's because the room's going to get used more if there's another purpose in the room. In fact, I don't even call it a dining room. It's a lounge. If this home is like a summer dress, this kitchen is the jewelry. We wanted it to have visual interest, but blend into the other living spaces. One of the ways I achieve that jewel-like feel is with the lighting. We use two chandeliers and two pendants, and all of them dialogue with each other. Together with the kitchen, this family room is the heart of the home. This room is all about celebrating the outdoors. You feel enveloped by mother nature. Believe me, there's no better designer than she is, but I've tried. I upholstered this huge sectional in indoor outdoor fabric, as I did these swivel chairs, which are positioned to give you a front row seat to summer. It was important that all the interior spaces flowed seamlessly to the outside, giving the home a continuous dialogue with the natural world. I organized the grounds, including the furniture and the flower beds, in a rectilinear pattern. This geometric formation makes it feel like a resort. Talk about a dream home, am I right? I based all the bedrooms on the theme of sand, sun, and surf. And the principal suite is a combination of all of those elements. How I achieved this is a very subtle way. For lighting, we brought in this white coral chandelier and raindrop sconces. And for a bit of drama, I covered the ceiling in a silver cork that refracts the light beautifully. And of course we went with a four post bed. I am designing a dream home after all. And these symmetrical porthole mirrors really round out the space. Another subtle nautical touch. In designing this dream home for my clients, I wanted it to be everything that they wanted it to be, which is happy hour every hour. I'm so glad you were able to join me. Thank you for coming. I'll see you at the beach. There's even more stunning homes and designs just waiting for you. Come on in, the water's fine. Like and subscribe, because a lot of these homes have spectacular pools.